morning guys. So I'm riding in the heart of the Driftless region just east of Portage, Wisconsin along Highway 33. I'm actually once again amongst a whole bunch of windmills. I tend to find them. That's probably more of the types of roads that I ride and the fact that I'm in the Midwest where there's a lot of these windmills. But I had a video recently talking about removing yourself from a situation or taking a step back getting the bigger picture of something to fully understand the situation that you're in. And I used myself being right up next to a windmill and pulling away from it to see actually what I was standing next to. As an example of that, how you couldn't see what I was standing next to until I pulled away from it. As you can see, Rosanati and myself are once again amongst the windmills, just like back in New Mexico. And it was a good poetic tool, I thought, in that video. But using the windmill, something a little negative happened that I didn't expect. And maybe I should have, but I was just a bit naive about it. Some some people commented about the windmill rather than the focus of the content of the message in my video, which was taking a step back to fully understand a situation you might be in. And they focused on the windmill itself. And the comments were very adamantly and very politically against windmills. Now, I will not ever express my opinion about windmills or guns or the environment or anything that's going to pull controversy or negativity into this channel. It's just not who I am. This channel is about motorcycles, travel, and how freaking amazing life is. And if you start talking about controversial subjects, it tends to bring in a lot of negativity which I want to avoid. And I get that I'm, because I'm talking about these things now, it's a, bit a, it's a bit like I'm bringing the negativity. And some of you might be asking, well, Joe, you have a platform. You have the ability to talk about these important topics. And my response is, fuck that. That's not what's important. Turning people away. What's up, buddy? How's it going, dudes? Turning people away from the channel is not a goal of mine. And those topics tend to do that. Now, I didn't make any comments about windmills when those comments were posted by some people. I don't care about the controversy about windmills. I mean, I do, but I'm not gonna express my opinion here because that's not what this channel is about. This channel is about the community that's developed around motorcycles. 
and all the friends that I've met along the way. Now, I guarantee, I guarantee that I disagree with some of the some of the subscribers out there, but that doesn't matter. That does not matter at all. What matters is the friendships that we're developing because of motorcycles. What matters is the friendships that develop because of the broader message of this channel. And that's motorcycles, how amazing travel is, and more importantly, how freaking amazing life is. Sure, you may think that these windmills are an eyesore. Sure, you may think that these windmills bring power to the masses in a way that hasn't been envisioned before. Sure, you may think that these windmills are more environmentally damaging than other forms of power. I don't give a flying f about any of that. For me, it was a nice visual tool on multiple occasions on this channel. If you feel inclined, go ahead and leave some negative comments about windmills or positive comments about windmills. I am not going to comment on those. But if you want to say comments about how motorcycling has changed you, how motorcycling has made you a better person, how you are so ecstatic about the friendships that have developed because of motorcycling, how many amazing people you met because of your travel experiences, how your path to happiness has been envisioned through all of this. Go ahead and leave some comments below about that. Because that's what this is about, guys. That's what excites me. That's what floats my boat. What floats my boat here is this guy here. I'm going to give him some fingers there. When I read negative comments, I do one of three things. One, I politely say how somebody's being inappropriate, which is rare. You really got to hit a trigger point for me to do that. And the surefire way to do that is to tell me I'm not being honest or being real. It's about the only time I'll criticize you. The other is, I'll just downright ignore the comment. I'll leave it up, but I'll ignore it. But if you've been known to have some negative comments in the past and you're negative, I'll just go ahead and block you from the channel. And there's a, a few people out there I've done that. Like your comment is just gonna be ignored, you know? So that's what I got for you guys here. I just thought I needed to address that because some people may ask, well, Joe, why didn't you comment on my windmill comment? Or Joe, why aren't you more political? So I thought it was important to address that. I don't think, I don't think that's what's important for this channel. And that's not what this channel is about. Anyway, let me know what you think about all that. Leave some comments below about it. Thanks for watching this one, everybody. If you enjoyed this video, click that like button. It helps out this channel a ton. More importantly, ride safe out there. Be kind and keep your wheels rolling in the right direction. I'll see you in the next video.